All right, thanks, Nick. Well, a local bar in the Black Rock neighborhood is up for a James Beard Award, one of the most prestigious awards in the culinary world. The bar, Waxlight Bar of Inn, is up for the honor of outstanding wine and other beverages. And this is the second year in a row they have been nominated. We are joined by the owner of Waxlight, Jess Forster. Jess, congratulations Thank on you. making it to this next step. How are you feeling? It's incredible. I'm, we're elated, uh, a little shocked, um, but really just honored and humbled to be on this kind of like national level. Talk about the category that you guys are nominated for. Sure, so it's Outstanding Wine Program and Other Beverages. Uh, so that includes our cocktails and our spirits um, and obviously our wine program. Um, so it's about service and hospitality, um, things like uh, pairing beverages with food, that's a big part of it, um, serving wine in correct glasses and things like that. This is such a, a big deal. It's a, prestigious award. This is the second year you guys have made it this far. Uh, what does that mean for you and for the business? I mean, it's it's awesome. It's a, a testament to our hard work. Um, you know, the four of us uh, who are all business partners uh, in the restaurant have, we have a lot of experience behind us. Uh, so just to have it all culminate into this national spotlight is an honor um, and it's so great for Buffalo too um, to you know kind of get some recognition for the amazing talent that we have in the city. What happens next? <laughs> so uh, they send a secret chopper basically uh, a judge uh, for the James Beard Foundation who comes in uh, and you know just experiences wax light um, and then after that uh, they kind of tally the scores and the top score obviously gets the nomination or the, the award, but uh, there's an award ceremony uh, June 10th in Chicago, which we'll be attending. It's a whole black tie affair with a red carpet. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> Sounds exciting. Um, have you noticed more traffic at the bar since receiving this recognition? Yes, definitely. I mean, I think also, you know, this coming in the same week as the Eclipse Week, we business has kind of skyrocketed. Um, but certainly people are coming in and congratulating us and saying, I saw this, you know, what, what do you have to offer? What's, you know, what can we experience? Um, so yeah, definitely an uptick in reservations for the whole month too. <laughs> and then just, just talk about for people who have never been at Waxlight, what can they expect if they go there? Sure, so, uh, you know, we're an owner operated restaurant. Um, so you're always gonna be taken care of by an owner, whether um, picking your wine, uh, making your food, making your cocktails, uh, serving you. Um, so it's, we try to, make an experience for, for guests um, and that everybody is, you know, kind of treated um, as if they're the only person in the dining room. Um, we do tasting menus once a month. Um, so we love to pair wine with food and you can do that anytime you come in as well. So if you're just coming in on a Wednesday or Thursday night and you want us to pair uh, wine with your meal, kind of a la minute, we can do that. All right. Well, Good luck. Thank um, you. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be all great. Thanks for stopping in this morning as well. And stay with us, meteorologist Nick.